Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video in this Django tutorial series. And this video is about what you're going to be creating throughout this tutorial series. So uh, I've already deployed the website that I have created. It's movie review 101.herokuapp.com so it may look like you know general for right now but it has a lot of good stuff that you can do with it so first let me show you what it's like to you know register a new user we'll just say new 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 at user.com okay so now that you are logged in as a new user you can log out so that's the basic feature that you can do with the registration new and then log in over here and then log out from here so okay so there's an add movies button here which you won't be able to access it I should remove this in later in the video but uh, if you're an admin you will you will be able to add movies so let's just go ahead and log in as an admin first and then let me show you what you're gonna be doing so to add movies we'll just say we'll say the Shawshank Redemption and we'll just say any particular date it doesn't matter the Shawshank Redemption let's get the image we'll just open image in the new tab copy the link and then paste it over here and then we'll just do add movies so similarly let's go ahead and add more movies So we'll just go ahead and add a bunch of random movies. We'll just add Mulan. And then let's go to image. Open image in new tab, copy it, and then add it. We'll say Mulan for right now. We'll just add this to, you know, be big, be big, and just the image to make it look beautiful. It shouldn't take much time, but I don't know why it's taking that long. Okay, there we go. There's Mulan. So basically, the design is there are movies three in a row, and then it will go down, down, down with three in each rows. So only admin can add movies not any other users so now let's log in as the new user so the new user is not uh admin so he he or she cannot add movies but they can add reviews so they'll go to the details and here's a cool picture there's the details the director cost and the rating so this is already you know been tested let me do in the new movie Mulan over here which has not been tasted so uh, the rating is zero right now because there are no ratings at all so we'll just add a review we'll say this was a fun movie to watch and to give a rating we'll just scroll this to we'll just give it a 7.5 and add review and there you go it says this was a fun movie to watch you can edit it and you can say fun movie to watch right and then we'll just save it and there you go fun movie to watch right question mark and then you can even delete it and it will pop up saying are you sure you want to delete it and then let's log in as a different user I'm not sure if there's a test okay so let's go ahead and give our review saying awesome content <laughs> and we'll just give a bad rating though like 1.5 and add it so test give awesome content new give this was a fun movie to watch and the aggregate rating is 4.5 out of both of these so as you have noticed there is edit delete in this one but not over here that's because you this is the comment of I mean the rating of test and you're logged in as test but you're not logged in as new so that's the user permissions in Django and then you can also search movies so we'll say dark 
and there you go it shows the dark knight and this is shank it will give you the saw shank redemption and also as an admin what you can do is let me show you real quick you can edit the movie if you want we can say director is not bbeg it's bbeg or whatever you want to change change it and there you go to change it the director over here if you want to delete the movie same thing it will give you a pop-up saying do you want to really delete it or not and so basically that's what we are going to be creating it may seem you know pretty confusing to get re really started but the course is really going to be you know slow paced and it will explain a lot of the terms and in case if you you know find any troubles just let me know in the comment section below and i'll try to answer all of those but yeah that's what you're going to be creating by the end of the tutorial series and if you feel like it's something that you want to learn then please stick around to all my videos because they are really good and it's really helpful you will also learn how to deploy it in a real actual url and everybody will be able to access it and all the things like that so by the time i upload i finish uploading all these content i will disable this link so you won't be able to access it so thanks for watching keep watching and stay tuned for my next video thank you